and welcome. Well, I've been inspired by some old pictures that I've come across, doing some research uh, about Albuquerque and the history like I like to do. And I was digging in the uh, University of New Mexico archive and came across quite a few pictures I hadn't seen before. So I thought it'd be fun just to go around town, mostly downtown, uh, here in Old Town now, we're gonna start here, and maybe up in Knob Hill area, and just see how close we can match those pictures. Uh, it'll be challenging, but let's see if we can do it. Now here is where Albuquerque actually started. The Old Town area, then it moved uh, north and east, to the uh, downtown area. But our first picture we're going to try to match here. Uh, now some of these pictures had a little bit of snippet on the back so I've got to kind of take that and figure it out. Some didn't have anything so just got to figure it out. So this first picture said that it was in Old Town and looking north on Rio Grande and that's what we're doing right now. We're in Old Town looking north so let's see if we can match this picture up now I really need to get out in the middle of the street but that's a little dangerous so let's see if we can match this up right about here I'm just guessing now the picture did say west of Rio Grande but there's no streets that go north west of Rio Grande unless it did many years ago but I think this is this is my best guess for this Okay, we are now in the uh, courts section, what I like to call it, downtown, near Lomas and Second. Now this one's going to be really hard. I had forgotten about these trees here, but uh, I'm familiar with it. And this next picture I'm going to try to match up is from 1979. So, it's going to be tough, but you can see the base of that uh, statue there. And this picture would be going facing south. Better look at this little park. And you can see where that pioneer woman is facing west. And a little boy holding on to, to a big old musket, I guess. But yeah, this shot is down here. I thought it was pretty darn interesting. Okay, we are now approaching second and silver. I'm not sure how I'm going to get this one, but we're going to come around here and Maybe park over here for a second. There's a lot of people around, a lot of traffic for this early. But uh, I'm assuming this picture is right about here. I'm not sure if it's looking north or south. Now this is turning out to be a little more challenging than I thought. <laughs> but uh, let's keep going you think you've found a place then you can't park and you don't want to walk because there's some I hate to say it, some unsavory people you don't want to walk by plus I wrench my back so it's kind of hard to get in now the car but uh, <laughs> gotta get her done get her done Okay, we are on Gold, Gold Avenue, and uh, this will be First Street up here. And this next picture should be on Gold between First and Second, and I'm assuming on the north side of the street. First Street is where the transportation center is, railroad and buses. So we're going to get over here without getting runned over. Ran over, run over, 
and it should be a shot right about here. Alrighty then, now we're gonna walk down Gold West and I believe the next picture should be between uh, second and third on Gold and I believe on the south side of the street. So let's take a trek down there and see if that matches up. I just noticed this. I gotta stop and check this out. Wow, this was the Central Bank building, 1905. All right, we are past second here on gold, and I believe it's gonna be right down here to the left. Now this one here, I kept walking up and down the street, wonder if it's the left side, you know, the south or the north. But this is the only thing that kind of matches. You can see the building, the yellow building there that looks like the roof goes down and back there. So hard after a hundred and something years. But uh, that's my best guess right there. Now this next shot is going to be kind of tricky because I don't know what angle they took this at. See that badge up there that says uh, Occidental Life Building? This next picture, I've got to figure out what angle they took it from. Okay, I figured this one out. And this building right here was that little uh, building right to the left. Very small building next to the Occidental Life Building. Now a lot of these pictures were taken from high up on a rooftop or something. So I know this is for sure because there's a little, there's the badge that isn't on the exact corner. There's another three or four feet of building. So that's it. Also the building in the background, I'll show you by going around the corner. Okay, I'm up here near 3rd Street, looking around the edge, and that building straight back, right in the middle of the screen, is the building you can see behind in that picture. Cool, cool, cool. Now this next picture I want to show you is not somewhere that I can really get to because it was taken from the air. It was taken from an airplane, and it said that it was one of the first, if not the first, picture taken from the air, at least of the southwest. Okay, these next uh, few pictures are going to be rough because we're going right into the sun. Plus, I'm standing out in the middle of the street, so. But I know that's correct because of that building on the right with the little peak in the middle. That's one of the first still frame buildings in Albuquerque. But that should match up pretty good there. Those partiers make a lot of mess, huh? Jeez, they just throw stuff everywhere. Yes, sir. Now, I think this is interesting. This is looking west from about 4th Street on Central, which used to be called Railroad Avenue, by the way. See how you see that chemo sign there? Right to the right, just barely to the right. Now, this next picture we're going to find where I don't even see the sign at all. I've never seen that before. Yeah, my nightlife video, I was able to walk right in there. This is the way, I, this is what I usually run into. <laughs> A gate. I just happened to catch it open. Let's see, I think I need to get down there on the left. Now check this next picture out. Is it my imagination or is that chemo sign not there? And why is it not there? I know this is the right direction because I can see that uh, that big building in the back there. 
Interesting. Okay, I'm now at First and Central, or Railroad Avenue, if you'd like to call that today. Okay, I thought this was interesting. There was a building right here, looking that way, and you can see that uh, bank, the little uh, square top there, to the left of the screen. And now I'm in the middle of the street, looking straight back, and that should be a shot of this right here. Too many people yelling and screaming around here. Let's get out of here. I'm gonna head up to Knob Hill. There's a couple areas up there I wanna check out, see if we can match up. Let's go. Okay, our first try here in Knob Hill. I know this is correct. Uh, because that people shop right there to the right has been there for a gazillion years. And you can see the uh, sky rise uh, up there on San Mateo and Central and the Zaz Hotel. Yeah, that used to be the Travel Lodge. I did a video on that and I mentioned that uh, my family may have stayed there at one time or another. But uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Now this one I wanted to show last because I know exactly where it is. And this is a very famous picture. Most people in this area have seen this picture. I keep getting run over, but this is this picture, believe it or not. Look how much was going on back then, and it was shot at night. About the uh, mid-50s or, or, or so. Isn't that awesome? You can see the Carlisle, Carlisle street sign right there to the, kind of the top middle. Love it. This has been challenging in several different ways. Hard to walk because of my back. I haven't had back problems in many, many years. I used to have serious uh, lower back problems where I was at the doctor, the chiropractor, medications. It's the first time I've had it this bad in a long time. Don't want you to feel sorry for me, but just challenging in that, in the, the, the traffic uh, and the, the people and trying to match things up. but. We did it. We did it. Oh, I feel good about that. I hope you enjoyed it. Now it's time to go home and nurse my back and to get ready for the next video. Hope to see you then. Take care of yourself. Bye for now. That bus is going the wrong way. It's on the wrong side. Another bus is coming and you had to go out in the middle of the street to, to miss him. <laughs> Yeesh.